the actors and actresses from uh, Hollywood, they wanted to send a special message to Dundee and to Scotland. Um, so I'm going to get off this mic, forget it's me, and just leave it. Thank you for coming out to see our movie Ride. It's based on the crazy, awesome, true story of John Bolton's, and I'm so glad that I can call him a friend, and I'm so glad to play a part in this movie. Ooh, hello, Bundy! <laughs> Hi! <laughs> I'm Sasha Alexander, and I play Mariana in the movie, and I just, I'm just so proud to be a part of this film. And the best thing about making it was getting to meet John and getting to share in this experience with him, and I'm so, so happy to have been just a little part of it. And I thank you, John, and Mariana and Eldridge. Congratulations on your wedding anniversary. Hey guys, how you doing? It's Brian Craig. I'm so excited that you all are coming to see Ride, the story of John Bolchens. Um, I was more than honored to be a part of it. Uh, the story was extremely compelling to me when I read it. Uh, I think there's a lot of really good lessons to be learned in it, and it's a very appropriate movie in the time right now. John, you've come a long way, man. I, I'm just so thankful that you had me be a part of it. Hello, Dundee. It's Jessica Michelle here. I'm so glad that you guys have all come out to see the movie Ride. Um, it's a powerful message and a beautiful story. And it's funny how life comes full circle. And here you are, sitting in the theater now that used to be where John would ride in, uh, what's just a warehouse. Hi, hello, my name's Blake, and I play Rory, and um, it's very nice to see all of you tonight. <laughs> um, I wish I could be in Dundee enjoying the screening with you. I would like to wish Mariana and Eldridge a very happy anniversary. Um, this we would all not be here without you two, and uh, it's quite amazing what the power that love can have on the world, and that's what this film is about. It's about overcoming fear and hate and with uh, courage and love, and that's what this film meant to me. Hi everyone, this is Ali and Shara. I'm sorry I can't be there with you guys, but I think you guys are going to have a great time. I hope you enjoy the movie. Uh, we were really thrilled to make this with John. Uh, I was I was beyond uh, beyond um, beyond words in it to play Scott Carroll. So Mary, I believe you're in the audience. Woo! Thank you so much for uh, trying to. For John's amazing movie called Ride, his life story. I wish I could be there. Hopefully, I get to see it when it premieres here. Um, stoked to be uh, having a little cameo in the movie, and I hope you enjoyed the film. And I just want to give a, a super huge shout out to the Dundee. Um, <laughs> Hardcore Skate Squad. <laughs> a fantastic story that he, he, he learned his trade here as a BMXer in the old factory warehouse homemade ramps in a, in a warehouse derelict breaking in stealing wood and he's end up with a book and a life story and a film and it gets shown here amongst all his friends what a fantastic story he must be absolutely made up fantastic and Mariana and Eldridge are two of the best people yes. you could ever meet yeah. and the courage they had to take on a child yeah. and give that child, yeah. children, ch everything and child a chance. Has, has had such, such a bad start in life and they saw in him something they could help with and something they, they've nurtured and look what it's turned into. It's just fantastic. Amazing. Absolutely. Bags of energy. John's always had bags of energy. He's always been that big personality. Uh, it's like if anyone was going to bring a Hollywood movie back to Scotland it was going to be John and he has and uh, he's living his, his dream and uh, Loads of respect for his parents for uh, all the effort he's put into. I spoke to Eldridge, met him tonight, and uh, and I said, "Well done, Eldridge. You, you did a good job." And he said, uh, "It wasn't easy, but then parenting's no easy, and parenting kids with troubles is probably even less easy." So uh, a lot of respect for them and John for what he's achieved. 
Well done, John. Yeah, pretty inspiring. I think I, I think that just shows like my life how two wheels, something as simple as that, can totally uh, lead your life and like inspire you and do something like really positive, like can keep you on track. It keeps you like really good friends and. Just, you know, the film is good. It's like um, you know, it just shows you you can come through anything, and well, you mean you have to look at what John's done here. It's like uh, he's come kind of full circle. He's, he's back here again, where he grew up, and he has done so well for himself. He, unbelievable for a guy coming from where he came from, what he's went through, and when you know his story, it's unbelievable. I think it was inspirational. It's great to show children that there is a different way. We push them towards academia and I think sometimes there can be a different path to happiness, not necessarily to success, but to happiness. And that's what he showed. Um, just through BMX, through riding with him through all the 90s when all the Scottish guys would come, come down south. And so just as a BMXer, I didn't know any of his story, any of his history. The movie was unbelievable and to watch it in this environment was amazing. It really was. Like, really emotional to see people involved on the screen all watching the movie. It was, it was yeah, uh, uh, quite an emotional experience. Very enjoyable. I really enjoyed the movie. Um, saw a lot of sides to join that I knew bits and pieces of, but I didn't know a lot of it. Um, and I thought uh, it just shows you, you know, in the kind of face of adversity, that's what you can achieve if you really put your mind to it. So it was uh, quite an inspirational movie, and I think a lot of people will take that away from it as well. Incredible, absolutely incredible. And I think, um, like fully, I've only known John for maybe three years, fully, but um, he's one of those dudes that I've met. And when you feel like you've met someone that you it's weird because you meet loads of people, especially what I do, you meet millions of people each year, loads of people. But when you really meet someone that you feel like, all of a sudden you feel like you've known them your whole life, and it's like, mm. there's only a select amount of people that, like that. Mm. And um, we clicked right away, and um, John stayed at my house a few times and everything, and we always talk about everything, and it's like I left home at 14 years old, and obviously it's not, I've not had an as harsh life as what he has. But I chose my own path and he done his own thing as well. And um, I think it goes to show we're both in small areas, like, and there's no reason why you can't be anyone that you want to be. I think a lot of people, a lot of kids back home and everyone, they always think, oh no, that can never be me, that can never be me. Well, it can. John is generally the voice of people, like kids that think, oh no, this can't happen from here, I'm from, I'm from here, I'm from there, I'm from there, yeah. I'm from this and that, but at the end of the day, it doesn't matter where you're from, we're all made of the same stuff, that's and that's it, and it's like you can do anything you want. If you if you dream it, and you want it bad enough, you'll visualise it, and all of a sudden it turns into that, mm -hmm. and it's like you look back at it, and it's like, oh, I'm already there, I've done that, so what's next? So you just keep striving and driving and driving. <laughs> <laughs> What did you think of the movie? Fish. <laughs> <laughs> the movie was impressive. It was good. It, and, and, uh, it, it opened a whole new avenue to John that we did not know. He's a, a man of many sides. And we did not know that until you see the film. And um, I've known John for a long time. And it was not... I mean, like, you hear things over the period. Little things, you're like... What's this? But that film kind of opened everything up. So it was a, it was a real eye opener to John and how he is today. <laughs> <laughs> it's nailed it.